George Brown College is happy to announce another update to one of our online technical training programs. Our PLC Technician Certificate Program course has been updated to include some new features and content. In this video, we'll be discussing the course content added to the module dealing with program flow instructions, as well as content additions relating to the module on process control. We will also be discussing the updates to the PLC Logic Simulation software. We'll begin with the additions to Module 10. A new section dealing with interrupts has been added to this module. Interrupts are used in PLC applications to address unexpected or undesirable conditions or events. They can be used to protect equipment, trigger alarms, suspend operations, as well as suspend regular program execution to perform specific tasks at regularly timed intervals. The four general types of interrupts shown here are discussed in the module and examples of each are given. A section has also been added to our process control module. It deals with the PID instruction. Closed loop control applications commonly employ PID instructions. PID instruction uses an algorithm to correct the error between a measured process variable and a desired set point. The PID instruction allows the user to implement the mathematical functions of a PID loop by setting certain parameters. The setting of these parameters does not require extensive knowledge of algorithms and equations which are usually needed for PID tuning. The module then goes on to walk you through the steps to perform the Ziegler-Nichols method for PID tuning. We'll move on now to discuss the additions to the PLC software simulation package that accompanies the PLC Technician Certificate Program. A new Valve 3D World environment has been added to the PLC Logic Simulation software. Alternate versions of both the single air compressor and batch mixer have also been included. All three of these added 3D environments utilize the analog I.O. extensively. In addition to the new 3D environments, these instructions have been added to the basic instruction set. These instructions provide the simulation support to reinforce the new content covered in modules 10 and 14. Simulating closed-loop PID control applications is now possible. The PID instruction allows the operator to shape the response to disturbances in the system. The ability to create examples and test the behavior of applications using the PLC Logic Virtual Simulation environment plays a key role in student comprehension and material retention. The addition of the interrupt functionality, as well as having a working PID instruction, constitutes a significant enhancement to the overall simulation functionality of the product. Another addition to the PLC software simulation software is the trend feature. This feature allows the user to monitor variables in real time. Clicking on trends from the program tree brings up the trends dialog box. This allows the user to define variables, addresses, or instruction element parameters to monitor in real time during simulation. With the Trends dialog box open, the user is provided with the instantaneous numerical value present at the specified memory location, along with its historical minimum and maximum values. The specified memory location's data also gets plotted graphically over time for review and analysis. Targeted groups of file addresses or instruction parameters can be referenced and monitored easily with this new feature. In addition to the trend feature, external data is also being plotted with the 3D environments that utilize Analog I.O. The data can be accessed by bringing up either the I7 or 08 Analog I.O. module configuration dialog box. Select the button on the right corresponding to the I.O. world that you are currently working with. This data lends insight into the control or behavior of devices and elements within the environment. 
Examples of this external data include temperature, pressure, flow rate, and motor RPM, to name a few. The additional data is provided to lend insight to the application's workings. In closing, the additional functionality, additional data tracking tools, and added analog I.O. utilization in the 3D application environments combined to constitute a significant improvement in overall topic coverage. For more information on this or any of the other technician certificate programs offered by George Brown College, contact us at the information shown here.